installing Kalinux as a virtual machine. So far we've seen how to install Kalinux as main operating system, but in this video I will show you how to set up your Kalinux as a virtual machine. So if, if you are new in Linux, you can start with creating your own safe environment, and this is to, pre to prevent your computer from the issues that could be happen. We are going to use a program called VirtualBox in order to do that. VirtualBox is a software virtualization package that installs on an operating system as an application. Also, VirtualBox allows additional operating system to be installed on it. Let's say one in is Kali Linux and the other operating system is Windows. So you don't have to buy another computer in order to test the security in a certain operating system. This video is divided into two main parts. The first part shows you how to install Kali Linux as your main operating system using VirtualBox program. And the second part shows you how to install Kali Linux using a program called VMware Workstation. The both programs are used to run a certain operating system as a virtual machine. But the main difference between VirtualBox and VMware Workstation is that VirtualBox is free while VMware Workstation is paid. But you can download VMware Workstation as a free tutorial. It gives you one month for free. Now let's see how we can do that. First, we are going to install Kalinux as a virtual machine and we are going to use VirtualBox program. You can download it from the link in the description or you can go to virtualbox.org.org. And for Kalinux, just go to the link in the description and you will see a VMware image or VirtualBox or Hyper-V. Select VirtualBox and select your uh, processor, whether it's 64-bit or 32-bit. Just click on it and install it. In my case, I have already installed it. And let me first install VirtualBox program on my uh, Windows machine. It's very simple and easy. Next. And next. I'm gonna remove this. Okay, next. Yes, next, install. Okay, so I'm gonna say finish. Let me delete everything from here. And remove, delete all files. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, after downloading this file, which is a uh, Cal Linux virtual box image, here is it, I have already downloaded. Double click on it. And I'm going to say import to import the file that I have downloaded. And this process is going to take some time. So uh, just wait. Okay, so after importing your Cal Linux uh, to your virtual box, click on it and go to setting and then go to system and give it to gigabyte, gigabyte of RAMs. I think this is enough to run Cal Linux perfectly. And then go to network and make sure that it's on NAT. Then click on OK and start. Enter. And now Kali Linux will install automatically as a virtual box and you don't have to do anything. Now type the username which is root and the password tour, which is uh, T-W-O-R. Then press enter. And now Kali Linux is ready to use. Uh, so we learned how to install Kali Linux as a virtual machine using pr the program uh, VirtualBox. And in the next video, I'm gonna show you how to install Kali Linux also as a virtual machine, but instead of using VirtualBox program, we're gonna use a VMware Workstation program because in my opinion, it's faster and more function than uh, virtual box.